cheap shot. Every look, Luke from Cheap Shot Entertainment. Um, going to well, we're playing PS2 demo discs. Some demo discs have come my way. And uh, by come my way, I mean I bought them when they were available, and they're in the official PlayStation 2 magazine demo discs. This is number 37. There are some gaps. Not quite sure where the other ones have gone, but I did have every single copy um, right up until. Well, probably since, until I went to university, to be honest, and then even beyond that, um, which was 2004. So, I've uh, got another demo disc to play, and I thought I'd share it with you. I was by, you know, acquired, like I say, I put them somewhere, found them, uh, and I'm playing through them again. You know, a bit of nostalgia during the COVID 19 lockdown, and I'm sharing them with you guys, so I'm hoping that you appreciate the videos. You know what to do if you do, people. You know. Anyway, uh, we've got some good games. We've played some of them before. Played Splinter Cell on a previous game. Got Great Escape. Played Ultra Echo. Played Ape Escape 2. Got Castle Wolfenstein. Pretty sure we played Die Hard, although I can't find any remnants of it on any other disc. Dynasty Warriors. Uh, in fact, I think I played Die Hard just on the off chance. Um, just before I did a quiz, so I don't think I've recorded that. Got Dynasty Warriors, which we played um, hack and slash, uh, Japanese hack and slash game that is decent but not my kind of game. Um, Metal Gear Solid 2, again, something that I never got into. Uh, Ratchet and Clank, we've played that, and Splashdown. So we've got a few games to play. On this one, let's start with Splashdown 2 and see where we go from there. So, like I say, you're watching Cheap Shot Entertainment, and uh, this is the gaming part of the channel. So, we're... sorry about that, people. Occasionally, these demo discs uh, they change the resolution so it quits the recording and then comes back. Uh, but, yeah, I will talk about. Uh, about these games because these are my nostalgia, these are my childhood really. Um, so I'm guessing this is some kind of uh, wave racer type thing. Um, so yeah. A very, uh, very adventurous kind of music. <laughs> I'm quite fit with the whole idea. Oops. Yeah, I think. Uh, oops. Oh. Yeah, that's kind of, the kind of music doesn't really fit with the whole wave racer type of thing. I'm a bit, uh, oops, we've gone off course again. Yeah. Oh. Off track. <laughs> I'm into the water. Um, yeah, I mean, it's perfectly acceptable. Oh, there you go. To the cave. A bit of a trick. No, I wouldn't do the trick that time. Uh, I can see why it's a bit adventurous. Oh, I wouldn't see. Uh, Indiana Jones skiing around on one of these. Oops. Oh no! <laughs> oh, yeah, just sent me straight into the uh, barrels. Cheers for that, lads. 
<laughs> I can't blame anybody else for that, but me. I suppose the, uh, the adventure of music is okay, I mean it is. I suppose, oh. I can't see. I can't see where I'm going. Brilliant. I can't see. Uh, no, I can't. Still can't see where I'm going. Uh, the camera has just bombed on me. So. Um, Well, clearly not going to finish this because I can't see where the hell I'm going. Um, Just spread that on your back. Yeah. Well, hopefully someone else will uh, finish. <laughs> Uh, and uh, put me out of my misery because this camera's not good. I mean, I'm not good at this game really, but uh, the camera's not really helping. I can't see a damn thing. I'm not going to win so I can stop playing the game. Games, extreme sports games, as I put this in that category uh, where I've just picked up the controller and it's been part of the lap. Wonderful. Um, yeah, pick up the controller and uh, just get on with it, really. Uh, but this one's not quite that um, at all. Mm -hmm. oh, I'm only on two out of three laps. You know what? Chaps and chapetters. I am out of here on that one. That's going to take me forever. Um, like I say, I think, you know, with a better camera, that I could get behind that game, to be honest. Uh, not a great experience on this occasion, but, uh, you know, I'm, I'm always willing to give give things a, another try. Um, and seeing it for what it is, it is a demo, after all, you know. Uh, great Escape, yes. Uh, this is the feature on the box. Be cooler, be the cooler king and play this massive two level demo right now. Well, there you go. Everybody seen The Great Escape? Really good film. MGM Interactive.
for tall games. Ah, the classic music. Everybody recognise the music now? A few scenes from the film. Right, let's skip past that. Now go medium. Struggle in the mountains. Stealth, notebook, peak cameras, character movement, brilliant. Zooms, action, stance, peak, attack, attack, strangle, inventory. Once on the mountainside, things will be tough. The area is crawling with guards and is swept by searchlights. With no ID papers, getting out of the area will be difficult. So look for a weapon. This should distract the goons at the main obstacle between you and freedom. Okay. Don't expect much on this. It's got stealth in it. <laughs> Intercept the phone call from the castle. Find any weapons to help you escape. Reach the escape point using all means available. You're dressed as a soldier. Stroll confidently. Imagine how different the Great Escape would have been if I was playing it. It's a really sad rendition of the music. That's really sad. Shall we try again? Uh, I didn't know how to answer him. I got a little bit further. Um, 
Let's try the other level. Let's give it a fair whack. I believe this may be a driving level. Ah, Francais. Yavol? Commerçant? Mais oui. Parlez-vous Francais? Un peu. Votre accent est très bon. Je l'ai étudié à l'école supérieure. Merci. Good luck. Thanks. Big X and McDonald have escaped. With no help from me, of course. Uh, so, objective is to escape. Uh, okay. Probably best. They don't have multiple objectives. I'm not generally not that bad at playing games. Just, uh... Okay. Never am. I don't, I don't know where we were supposed to go. I honestly don't know where we were supposed to go. I was following the other chap. We'll do another try because we we've got eleven playable demos. We've played most of them. I think I've got a basic idea of where to go now. So. Guessing okay. Um, that nice, it's a nice idea. Just uh, the controls are a bit. Yeah. That's a heck of a quote. So that was the great escape, everybody. We've already played Alter Echo, Flint and Cell, Ape Escape. Now let's go for Castle Wolfenstein. So more German. World War Two stuff. Playing this on VE Day as well, so that's uh, you know. 
Você tem. This is the return to Castle Wolfenstein. Journal, pursue SS paranormal personnel to the catacombs. Going to blah blah blah, yeah. Uh, elite guard, your orders to navigate the catacombs. Uh, must be heeded, reliable source. Professor then often carries a journal into the dig site. Uh, insight into his activities in Castle Wolfenstein. Again, another game that I've never really played. Obviously, it's got a lot of fanfare. Uh, it's a first-person shooter, I believe. Uh, not my favourite, I must admit, but uh, I can deal with it. It's fine. So this is the return to Castle, Castle Wolfenstein. Yeah, first person. Oh. And it's not inverted. I've got no excuse. Um, pieces of stuff People must think I'm absolutely awful at playing games. I'm not, honestly. I'm really not. make a lot of noise, don't they? Have another one. Oh, he was just a bag of bones. Blame it on first person controls because you know you've got to have a reliable source to uh, blame your failures on. Oh, 
one's going to make me do it again. Brilliant. One more go. Finally got past the bit that I got kept getting stuck on. Castle Wolfenstein people. Uh, I'll admit, so far this demo disc is not the best. For my personal taste, I mean I'm sure you know Castle Wolfenstein has been going for years and years and years, I'm sure people absolutely love it. The only real first person shooter that I really really do like is Duke Nukem, the original of course. Um, and I believe Die Hard is also a first person shooter, so bear with me. I love Duke Nukem, you can play that a lot. And Doom as well. Die Hard Vendetta. Now I did play this very briefly. Um, it's not good. I'll be honest. It's not good. Yes, I did. Clearly, that's why I'm here. What's your name? Oh my god. My name is Claudia Sherman. I'm from the valley. Are you okay? Are you injured? I was like so scared. Oh. John, what the hell are you doing here? Looking for my daughter. Lucy's here? Yes, sir. It was her first assignment. It seems she surprised the robbers. John, we've not heard anything from my people in there. Al, I know my Lucy's alive in there. When the alarm got triggered, it seems they panicked. They grabbed a group of hostages and sealed themselves inside. We're cutting through now. So what you got in mind, John? I don't know if being Lucy's father makes it a good thing for you to be here. Look, Al, I'm not leaving. Now, I'm not in uniform, so if I get spotted, I'll just make like I was a guest who got lost. Oh, yeah. You look like a real art lover, McLean. Well, I've always been partial to the odd comic book. Sir, we're in. McLean, don't try to stop me, Al. I was just gonna wish you luck. We'll be on the radio. Cool. Good luck, John.
a city. Are they invincible or something? Stay down here, you can't get me. Shoot him in the crotch. Objective fail. I went a bit further than I did last time, to be fair. Let's try that again. Oh my god, how could this happen? This is Damon Clayton, John. You get called in? Man, we just need some details from you. What's your name? Oh my god. My name is Claudia Sherman. I'm from the Valley. Oh my god. My name is Claudia Sherman. I'm from the Valley. Yes. Yes, you are. Good luck, John. Radio in as soon as you need assistance. We'll get Lucy back. Don't worry. Good luck, John. Radio in as soon as you need assistance. Sir, we're in. Four bullets it took to knock him down. Hey, well, I'm doing better already. Got 25 seconds left of the demo. As if leaning to one side would stop you getting shot there. And demo over! Yay! I would not wholeheartedly recommend any of those games, uh, but that's just me. Definitely that one, that was terrible. Uh, but at least Wolfenstein had something about it, it's just that I couldn't see any of the zombies. Um, but it was decent, but to say this is PS2 hardware, we're talking 2003, uh, there's been a lot better games, and like at this point in the life cycle, the PS2, we're getting a lot of rehash games on these demo discs, so um, probably a few fewer things to play. I think this is when you know they're coming up to release day, and they want to spam it, want to make sure people want to want to play it. Uh, and uh, yeah, I mean, 
this is around the time when iToy came out. I remember having iToy, Jack and Daxter 2, Amplitude. Um, it was like a music slash flight simulator game. Um, but yeah, and WRC 2 we played, so uh, we're not gonna, not gonna do that. That's when they started doing Platinum games. I mean, like we're three years into, nearly three years into the life cycle and Platinum games are coming out. So uh, join us for more. We're going on to disc 38 next. Uh, this disc is not the best, I'll be honest. There's been much better discs and uh, judging by what's on the covers and uh, sometimes you can't judge by the covers but judging by what's on the covers the upcoming games are a lot better than the ones on this disc this is definitely one of the poorest discs that i've played anyway uh if you're watching cheap shot entertainment i've been your host luke and goodbye Yeah.